Good morning. Today is the first day of orientation. We um, just got off the metro. We're walking up to Howard University School of Law. So we have a whole week of um, orientation. We'll be here from like 8.30 a.m. to 4 or 5 p.m. every day. So stay tuned. Waiting for Asia to be done with her um, video. <laughs> okay, I'm up here in the car with my boy Kamal. He's driving. Uh, so gracious enough to give us a ride. And then like Jasmine is back there, my cousin. Period, period. Yep. Period. And the then queen queen there's queen. Asia. The queen and, here. Wait, wait, <laughs> she says the queen. Y'all really cousins? Yes. Well, like, maybe. Mm. Yeah, y'all like play cousins. We, we just found it out. I feel like in Africa, you know, maybe the same tribe. So what you know about Africa? Something like that. Tell me about my uh, people. Tell me about my what, what? Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. What are you talking okay. to you? You know what? The Americans. Yeah, you're the like American tribe. You're going to get beat up. So hit me. Yeah, you're, you're, you're about. Yeah, you're about with me. Eh? I feel like you're. Yeah, because I really connect with Oshun. Oshun. Ah. <laughs> so I, I, maybe I'm going to learn a lot from Kamal about yeah. Nigerian heritage. But um, I was in the um, Charles King house and we won the competition that we had. But Asia actually won with her team the competition that they Asia had. Won. So it's really just Asia won. Yeah. I don't know and about the whole house. Profited. So we were split up in houses. That's what it was. And I think the the people who were like um, named, like who had the titles of the houses, these were alumni of um, Howard, right? Some people thought they were the orientation leaders. Yes, they have orientation leaders in law school. It just blew my mind. But, you know, it was a really good first day. I'm excited about the rest of the week and got a chance to finally meet the people that some of us have been talking to over the past few months. And um, some of them have a lot of character. Others don't have much, but you know, that's life. So, first day is a wrap. <laughs> so, I'm in the gym right now. Still trying to go to the gym during the weekday as much as I can. We're going to see how long this lasts. But just a short recap of today. Oh, my goodness. I'm just so grateful. I remember sitting on the second row today in the auditorium, and I just kept looking at the Howard University sign. Just kept telling myself, you really here. It just felt so surreal. It's been a dream for so long. But at the same time, the work is about to begin. Um, we had a phenomenal professor come and speak to us. 
and um, she was just talking about mission matters and just talking about us walking in our purpose and really, you know, embodying everything that Howard is as a university and law school. Uh, we went on and had some bonding activities. I am in the house of Charles King. So um, I am, we, we were split up in um, different houses and it was a combination of section one, two, and three. And we did a scavenger hunt in the house of Charles King, um, won the competition. I was really excited about that. That, that made me feel good. I was, it, was, it was a fun experience, but kind of stressful uh, because we were running around the law school trying to find like student affairs, the dean's office, the chapel, the printer in the library and take pictures in front of it. So that was fun. I think finally, one thing that stood out to me was we were supposed to have a professor come and speak to us uh, from 2.30 2 to 4.30. Um, and instead, we got in there and they were like, this is going to be um, an assignment time. They gave us a piece of paper with a case study on the front and a case study on the back, front and back. And we had to respond to it. The only instructions we were given was to either type it up or write it and scan it and send it to the email that was on the Promethean board above by 4.30. So you had two hours. How to respond, how long it would be, whatever. It, they, they didn't give any of that to us. So we completed it. It was, I guess, our first, I don't know, some people say hazing, some people say preparation, some people say taste, but it was something. And we did it, we got through it together. Um, and I was happy that we did it. I think it's, it's a good good practice for um, law school. But after that, we, um, you know, dispersed, came back home to get ready for tomorrow. I ain't gonna lie, whenever I got home, I fell out. I was tired. We had been together all day talking and, you know, preparing for next week and just learning a lot of information. So we gotta be back at it in the morning at 8.30. Until then, I'm out. Second day of orientation. I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready, I'm ready. Better in terms of you all trying to understand what it is we're trying to say. So, we will get started. I am gonna be talking about diversity, equity, and inclusion, but there will be a mindful mess. And we're wrapping up again, day two, Tuesday. Today was so much more, uh, I guess informative. There was a lot of information actually about the law. Yeah. So I think it eased some of our anxiety from yesterday with the um, thing that we did that we wrote about, but then it created more about like, because we got case studies we have to read tonight um, for tomorrow. So it's starting, it's real, but we are ready for it. You ready for it? I guess, <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Okay, these are these are my new classmates. Yes. You got section three, throw your threes up. Oh. <laughs> section two, and then who's section one? Section one. All right, we up in there. We up in there. All right, how are you? Yes. Uh, my name is Lionel Mackey. People call me Lonnie. I um, was a part of section three. Yeah. Woo! So I am on my way to go study, um, read actually. I have about 58, 60 pages to read um, for one class out of five um, by Monday. And this is Thursday of orientation week. So this should be fun. It's hot out here. We're headed to take our class picture. We all walking in front of the chapel on the steps. The largest um, law school class to ever walk the halls of this esteemed law school and institution. She is the mentor and these two are the mentees. I love it. This is so beautiful. Look at these people. This is so awesome. Everybody talking with their mentors. Thank you. 
so excited to partner with Bolsa, Celsa, and La Alianza for today's event. We're also very, very appreciative and grateful to Aiken Dump for sponsoring today's event and for providing such great food. Before we begin the panel discussion, we'll have each representative of Bolsa, Celsa, and La Alianza come up and give a brief overview of their organization. So without further ado, I will introduce Kayla Gardner of Bolsa. Uh, it's great to be here with you guys today. Yeah, My name is Alex Rose. I'm your SBA Vice President for the school year. Um, I'd like to take the chance to introduce you guys to some of these panelists. Every guy on this panel is extremely accomplished and extremely successful. And I encourage you to reach prior edition. So if your mentor has that prior, then you can still use it. Which well, one? Oliveira is here. Yeah. So do not use the older edition. It says yeah. that don't use the older edition. We may have low moments, we may face depression, we may face anxiety, but I really believe that if we stay together, if we stay connected, and if we put God first, it doesn't matter how many times we fall down, we'll rise back up. Mm. It doesn't matter what we face. All right, everybody, we are here. I like hustle, man. Say hello, everyone. Yeah, hello, hello, hello. Look who works hello. best. Look who works Y'all not speaking to the... Look who works best. They don't care. Okay. Let they the don't fans care. know. They don't care. Let the fans she know. She got the brown suit on. She wanted everybody to know, Jesus. Here we go. Ah, okay, Asia. <laughs> 